The coronavirus continues to mutate and wreak havoc, and the unvaccinated individual are more contagious and may lead to severe disease and are very concerning. Today's episode, I will be discussing to you about Lambda variant. But before that, let me introduce myself. I am Nurse Jane, based in the Philippines, and welcome to my YouTube channel. SARS-CoV-2 Lambda variant is also called Lineage C.37. It is first detected in Peru on December 2020. And according to WHO, it is considered as variant of interest on June 14, 2021. It is more infectious and it is attributed with T761 and L45Q mutations. So LSYL TPGD246-253 mutations, a unique 7 amino acid deletion mutation in the N-terminal domain of the Lambda variant spike protein is responsible for invasion from neutralizing antibodies. Since the Lambda variant has a dominant spread according to the increasing frequency of the isolates harboring the RSYL TPGD246-253 limitations, our data suggests that the insertion of the RSYL TPGD246-253 limitations is closely associated with the massive infection spread of Lambda variant. VOCs and VOIs have multiple mutations in the spike protein and are relatively resistant to neutralizing antibodies. Research on this specific variant is in the early stages and need more robust studies to understand the full extent of the strain's effect. Because lambda variant is variant of interest, it might be considered that this variant is not an ongoing threat compared to the pandemic variant of concern. However, lambda variant is relatively resistant to the vaccine-induced antisera. It might be possible that this variant is feasible to cause the breakthrough infection. Following the minimum health protocol is still effective in preventing the disease. And if you have the chance to get vaccinated, do your part and save lives. That's all for today. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Tap the notification bell so that you will be notified in my next video.